Now to the breaking news out of the Mueller investigation. Sources telling ABC News the former personal attorney for the president has reached a deal with special counsel Robert Mueller. Cohen appeared in federal court this morning and pled guilty to making false statements to Congress regarding the Russia investigation. ABC's Emily Rao has the latest. Michael Cohen walking out of federal court in New York this morning after pleading guilty to making misstatements to Congress when he testified last year about his contact with Russians during the presidential campaign. You're talking about the president's, potentially the president's knowledge about what he knew, when he knew it, connected to Russia totally different game here. Cohen is the former longtime personal attorney and fixer for President Trump, previously one of his most loyal defenders. But pleading guilty earlier this year to felony campaign finance violations for his role in arranging payments to Stormy Daniels and Karen McDougal. After that, Cohen saying he'd be loyal to his family and his country. And now, sources telling ABC News he spent more than 70 hours with the Mueller team, taking questions about contact between Russians and Trump associates during the campaign, and according to court documents, extensive details about Trump's business ties to Russia and the planning of a project in Moscow. The president leaving the White House today for the G20 summit in Argentina, calling Cohen a liar. Uh, he's a weak person, and what he's trying to do is get a reduced sentence. So he's lying about a project that everybody knew about. This morning, Representative Adam Schiff, the co-chair of the House Intelligence Committee. It means that when the president was representing during the campaign that he had no business interests in Russia, uh, that that wasn't true. Emily Rao, ABC News, Washington.